Hey YouTube, Aaron Killups here, and today I've got a Rustler VXL and sort of a Slash 4x4 update. Um, I think a couple of you saw my last video where I just, it's like a 7 second video, where I just put this in front of the camera so it's broken. Unfortunately guys, my Slash is broken again, and I know I said if something like this happened, I was going to sell it, and I really can't find the heart to sell it. It's my first RC and I'm really never going to sell it. Even if it's, like, blown up, like, if I drove over a landmine with it, I'd still keep it, because it's so special to me. First RC ever. I'm, I'm going to end up getting another Valenian motor, just because this one's old. Guys, this motor's two years old. Two freaking years old. And, um, it's been used and loved. So, I got some parts in here that I have to replace for the Slash. And I got the stuff fixed on my Rustler, so I'm going to show you guys today. Uh, I did get the Intigy bulkhead and some more rod ends. Not rod ends, sorry. Uh, I got shafts for my shocks. Um, I do need a new RPM front bumper because mine broke. It's just like hanging by a thread, so once that breaks, I'll get a new one. Um, I need to get, I just need to adjust my steering a little. There she is, all nice and pretty, before I bang her up and make it all messy again. <laughs> and, uh, oh, hopefully my Rustler is at its final upgrade for a while. Because, I mean, I'll just get additional upgrades that I ne don't need, but I hope I don't need to get any more parts for it. I mean, I'm so fed up with it breaking. My God. But, um, as you guys can see, I got my snow stuff on it, because it's supposed to snow this weekend. And, um, I will not be in town this next week, but happy Thanksgiving, you guys. Uh, if you live in the U.S., happy Thanksgiving. Um, and, yeah, sorry, my folks, camera went out of focus there. But, um, so I'm going to be out of town. I'm going to be visiting my aunt and uncle for Thanksgiving. And I won't be taking my RCs there, but, um... I will have this weekend, and I want to get a bashing video out really bad for you guys with my Rustler. Really, really bad. But so, that's probably not going to happen because the weather, the schoolwork. I've had one of the toughest years of my life so far, guys, in school. It's not as in kids and social problems, but just tough work, man. I'm crazy. Middle school is crazy hard. But, um, so, uh... Anyways, uh, I won't be able to do that much. I had a lot. I have a lot of homework over the break, surprisingly, stupid teachers. But um, I don't have any plans on. I think I come back. I don't know what day I come back. I think I get back on Saturday, so it is possible. And I keep promising to the, you guys these, so I should just shut up and stop saying I'm gonna give you a run video because you know I'm not. This weekend, I will try, try, try this Sunday or next Sunday to get a video out, and hopefully it's a run video. Maybe I'll take some footage tomorrow after I get my Slash for... Maybe I'll get both RC cars in one run video, so that would be awesome. So, I'm going to get a new Valenian motor, um, brand spanking new. Uh, I was <laughs> considering taking the one out of my Rustler and selling it as a roller, I didn't want to do that though. It's too much work, too much work selling it, and they just got it fixed. And I want to see how it performs for a while. Now, I, it, so, for last week's feedback question, it was what paint scheme should I do the body? And I asked if I should do an old one or a new one. Maybe I've already posted that video. I don't know. I think I said new, and the winner was new paint scheme. So I'm going to paint it a uh, sort of like my old body but kind of reversed, like with this yellow in the front, and no blue, it would be red and black, or red and gunmetal. So I would do the same kind of detailing, but I would do this in dark, dark black, and then I would have the rest of this be red, I would have the front be red, have like a kind of jagged design like this, and uh, have it end about right here, like where the window ends, and then have a, uh, a, uh, snap, a, <laughs> a gun metal back here, uh, and then the fins, I would probably paint those, I want to paint them gold for some reason, so, 
I don't know. That body is probably not going to be here until next year. So don't get your hopes up. But nobody cares about me, so <laughs> just kidding. But, um, crap, my dang light doesn't want to cooperate. But so, um, for this week's feedback question, I don't have anything about my trucks. I want you guys to give me feedback about what your worst crash ever was or what the worst breakage you've ever had with your truck. Because I know this is certainly certainly my worst. It's the most ex no, actually, I lied. B blowing up my rear differential was the worst. And most of you guys were like, like, oh, my God, I've done that before. <laughs> and, uh, but so, uh, this is definitely up there. It's probably up there in the top two. Uh, worst breakage ever. But so, write in the comments what your worst breakage ever was, because I, and, uh, I will announce the winner, in my opinion, next week on, or next two weeks on my next video, and, uh, I, whoever wins that, I guess you just get the glory of winning. So, uh, yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Remember to leave a like on the video, rate, comment, subscribe. I enjoy all your feedback. Uh, Last week was a pretty slow week for me, just a lot of schoolwork, lots of homework, lots of issues, just la da 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 I'm still really stressed out from it. But um, yeah guys, thanks for watching. Bye.